Hi fruit lovers, it's bright and early on a Saturday morning. A little bit of a sweater on here because uh, it's cool this morning, but um, I'll probably take it off soon because I've got lots of work to do. This is what I bought. I've got some uh, channel lock and wiggle wire. And I don't know, I think I've got this on Amazon. And this one I chose actually has the screws with it too and a head that allows you to screw those into the wall um what i'm going to be doing what i'm going to be doing is putting this uh, channel up on the outside of the barn then you put the frost cloth over the over this and then the wiggle wire goes in it to hold the cloth in and then that will be Oops, fell over. It's going to be enclosing my lean to here. Um, supposed to be getting down in the 40s next week. Won't need it for that. But January, almost certainly, I'll be going down into the 30s and then into the 20s, maybe. So, all these tropical trees will need protecting, these extra sensitive ones. Not sure. It's, I may even get a little heater. To put like a thermostatic heater put in here too but who knows i don't know if it'll need that main thing is that they have the uh, protection from the frost but yes these channel locks the wiggle wire the screws these are what are they like are they supposed to be six foot links bit taller than me but I think the six foot six yeah six foot six lengths uh, so I'll have to cut some of them to make the full enclosure six foot six so I'll need to cut some of them to uh, in half to give me the extra length so we'll let you see what's going on how this progresses they give you uh, 100 screws so I reckon that's five screws per um stick for the channel and they are self tappers so you can just drill them straight in there no need for a pre-hole well the self drilling screws that they give you give you a hundred screws so i reckon that's like uh five per channel four or five per channel don't go over that but they'll go into the side of the barn pretty easy but over here on these supports this is a lot uh, thicker so i'm gonna have to get a drill bit to help those uh self self tappers go in there there's some uh, pre-drilled holes here's a tip to put, put a piece of cardboard or um cloth down then if you drop your screws drop your then they'll fall onto the, conk, the uh, cardboard instead of falling in the grass. Alright, uh, almost done. Okay, I could have done with another channel up top, but I'm just going to use those clips for now. Um, and it really needs two people, one person to pull this tight, the other person to put the wiggle wire in. But what I've done is I've gone to the next one and put some wiggle wire in there just to hold it up. And then... Try and get it as tight as I can. Maybe like that corner, I'll have to go back and adjust it back there. But it's okay. Doesn't have to be. Doesn't have to be tight as a drum. It just has to keep the uh, frost out. Frost from falling in there. So there you go. Mission accomplished. I've got to take this down for now. Wait for the cold weather. Um, but there you go. Yes. Uh, Fanny's your dad's sister-in-law. All right. Bye.